angels my name is Ebony and in this video I'm going to give you affirmations that you can say to yourself or to the universe or to your angels or your higher self when you see angel number 999 the thing that I like about angel numbers triple nines or any nines is that the root number is always nine like no matter how many sequences of nines it is, it's like always nines. So the message is just, it intensifies the more nines that you see, but the vibe is still the same. The vibration is still the same. And I always think about closure when I see nines. I always tell myself, finish what you started. You know what I'm saying? Just finish what you started. So I think about, you know, closed doors, completions, things coming to an end, rebirth, things like that when I see nine. You are at an end of a life phase. The good thing about that is you're at the beginning of something new. So it's kind of like bittersweet, like, okay, it's over, but oh welcome in something else <laughs> so when you see this number your angels may be calling you to release whatever is holding you back from moving forward whatever your vices are your habits um, your choices your behaviors your relationships your friends you know what you need to let go of let it go your angels also want you to welcome in new love when you see this number so it may be like an end of a relationship a beginning of a new relationship a new phase in an existing relationship it's a good sign for your love life like okay this little rough patch we going through is over or this little um, time of being lonely is over or this time of separation is over so you know now it's time for another level that's a good little energy for the lovers Nines also represent unconditional love. And that's why I love YouTube so much because you got to have unconditional love to really love me because we, we are so much different from each other, but we have the same energy. It's an unconditional love no matter who you pray to, no matter how you seal your prayers, no matter um, who you believe in. We just really are um, about spreading love and positivity and peace and prosperity. So I appreciate you for that. And I just want to give you, from my consciousness to yours, some, um, some loving energy for everybody that's in the sound of my voice and can see this video. Because that's what this uh, number represents. Being generous, unconditional love, selflessness, and nines vibrate with the love frequency. And that's the highest vibration you can emit. So being that we're in 2020 and it is the universal year four, and I'm a life path for, I'm going to give you four affirmations that you can say to yourself or out loud or wherever when you see angel number 999 to kind of invoke the help of your angels, um, receive more divine insight, receive more clarity, like, you know, make it plain. So I like to recite affirmations. The first affirmation is I always finish what I start. Even if you are a procrastinator, like myself <laughs> you have to retrain your subconscious mind and you have to tell yourself i always finish what i start i'm gonna finish what i start like just tell yourself that because when you see triple nines any little effort that you make towards your goal is going to be rewarded so you want to just tell yourself like i finished like even if you don't completely finish just moving forward on your path is going to be so important for you just say that over and over. I always finish what I start. The second affirmation that I absolutely love is I don't bang on closed doors. When you see triple nines, some things are going to come to an end. Some doors are going to close. I don't know the way it's going to come to an end. They may leave you. They may close the door in your face. Let it go. Okay, trust me. Let it go. Don't bang on closed doors period ego will have you crying over a closed door with nothing behind it and rejection is god's protection so don't don't do that whatever's behind that door is not for you when something ends you don't need it anymore 
okay? So maybe your angels are letting you know they closed that door. Stop banging on it. So tell yourself that. I don't bang on closed doors like it's over. Okay, cool. It's easy for me to let go of the pieces that don't fit, baby. Easy. I don't know about you, but I ain't never lost nobody worth keeping. Never. Like, I ain't never lost nobody worth keeping, and they all come back. Okay? You ain't got to chase. And it ain't even nothing extra. It's just my whole energy is a vibe. Like, for real. I ain't never lost nobody worth keeping. And every last one of them came back. I ain't never had one not come back to me. So, you know, you need to just have that energy and know, like, that's your loss. You'll be back. <laughs> You'll be back. <laughs> they always come back. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, just change your energy. The third affirmation that I want to share with you is the better it gets, the better it gets. I love it. I love it. <laughs> okay, the better it gets, the better it gets. It only gets better. Anything that you lose is automatically going to be replaced with something better. Okay, you lose a crib. You're going to get a better crib. You lose a lover. You're going to get a better lover. You lose a car. You're going to get a better car. You lose your job. You're going to get a better job. Like, the better it gets, the better it gets. Okay, the destruction process gets a little messy. And it looks a little like, oh my gosh, what's going on? But trust me. You're divinely got it. You're tapped in. So trust is something bigger operating on your behalf. Don't look at what's going on right now and, and forget that something so much better is always coming. And the better it gets, the better it gets. Okay? So always tell yourself that. Like, okay, this phase is over. It's going to get a little better this time. It's another level. You're elevating. You're ascending to another level. So it's going to get better. The better it gets, the better it gets. And the last affirmation that you can tell yourself when you see angel number 999 is I practice non-judgment. You have to remind yourself that. I don't have an opinion on the way anybody chooses to live their life. I practice non-judgment. I don't care who you pray to. I don't care who you love up on. I don't care who you um, prefer. Like, you like light skins and i'm dark skins you like skinny girls and i'm a big girl you know what i'm saying you like white girls and i'm black i don't i don't have an opinion of the way you choose to live your life of course i don't want any children harmed whatsoever however i practice non-judgment that's all i can say i practice non-judgment like anytime i get to a place where you know i want to start you know putting my opinions and what I think other people need to be doing, I have to remind myself that I practice non-judgment. And I love everyone because I recognize the divinity in you and I'm not going to be judging you because I too am flawed. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I too have flaws. And I just want to remain humble and display humility and practice non-judgment. So I have to remind myself that like, Okay, who am I to say how another person should live their life? So that may be a powerful affirmation for you as well, especially when you see 999 because it represents universal love. And that means even when people are acting unloving, grumpy people need love too, mean people need love too, hurt people hurt people. It is our mission because we are vibrating at a higher level. It's our mission and it's our duty to demonstrate that universal love. Everybody can't be hating. You know what I'm saying? Somebody has to really detach and be like, you know what? I'm still going to operate from a place of love. So that's what this number represents. So just by saying I practice non-judgment, you will kind of put yourself in other people's shoes and you'll be a, a little more tight-lipped and a little less judgmental uh, when people go through their their valleys and they make their mistakes and they do things like that. You will come back and say, okay, I practice non-judgment though. I don't have an opinion on that right now. It'll work. Just try it. So, angels, I hope that I share with you a very powerful 
affirmation that you can use when you see angel number 999. I love you for having an unconditional love for me. I can be exactly who I am. I can show up as my authentic self. The love and the joy that I feel from that is immeasurable. So I thank you for that. I have some gifts for you. Check the links in my description. I love you, man. Join my mailing list. I'm going to show up for you every day. I'm showing up 2020. I'm going to shine my light. I'm encouraging you to do the same. We got the light. It's our year. It's our year, man. So I'll see you in the next video, angels. Make sure you like and subscribe to my channel. Click the bell and put a heart in my comments. You know I love hearts. Love is the highest vibration you can emit. Until the next video, angels.